Hello, everyone, and thank you so much for joining us today, Senior Marketing Specialist, um, with a product breakdown of National General and kind of turning into Allstate uh, product breakdown. So thank you so much for joining us here today. Um, my name is Sadie Palmer. I am the Team Leader of Training and Education here at Senior Marketing Specialist, and today we have Andy Larson from NatGen. If you've been on any of our webinars before, if you've seen our Senior Sales Summit or anything like that, you've probably seen um, Andy's face. So he will be presenting today. But before I pass over the reins to him, I have just a few housekeeping items. The first one is you have that Q&A box. Please feel free to use it. Um, I will be kind of fielding some of the questions for Andy today as he presents. Um, we will have a Q&A portion at the very end. So if you want to save your questions for then, that's totally fine. If not, go ahead and put them in the chat and um, we'll kind of throw them out as we go and we'll get those answered for you. Also today is recorded. So if you have to hop off or if you wanna go back and review anything, we will have it in our follow-up email as well as on our YouTube page for you to go back and watch. And then you will be receiving a follow-up call as well. Uh, just to make sure that we tie up any loose ends. If you have any questions that are lingering afterwards, you'll get a call from our team just to make sure that we get everything answered for you. So, Andy, uh, without further ado, I'm just going to go ahead and hand it right over to you. All right. Well, thank you. It's a pleasure to be back with you all again. And uh, uh, again, my name is Andy Larson, Regional Sales Director for National General. I'm going to take my, uh, my my face off camera as well here. Um, I don't want it to be a distraction. I've been told I have a face for radio, so let's just let's just keep this a radio show here. So, but uh, non nonetheless, um, as as uh, Sadie goes through some of the housekeeping items there, I encourage you to take your phones out and be be ready to take some snapshots here of QR codes that we're going to display throughout. Um, this is a way to get you connected with our teams in terms of uh, uh, getting onto our calendars. Um, to schedule time that's available for both you and us um, to, to talk about anything further, but also we have some uh, some other training sessions, National General related to to offer you as well, that will be uh, accessible through uh, uh, taking a snapshot of the QR code and uh, bookmarking those pages. Um, but uh, as we get uh, going here, uh, Sadie mentioned that we have some exciting changes coming up this week. And uh, as you have uh, come to know us as National General and been a champion of our brand, as of Friday, that goes away and we become officially Allstate Health Solutions. Now there's gonna be some transitional period in terms of a rebrand, as you can imagine, in terms of some of the different materials that are going to be uh, uh, coming your way in, uh, as far as marketing, brochures, those type of things, but what you can expect. And uh, we've seen some sneak peeks and look pretty good. Uh, just a rebrand of the systems as well that will have all state health solutions logos and color schemes and fonts and whatnot that will all be there but there will be certainly a transition period in terms of uh, some things that might be state uh, state specific that have to be refiled but in terms of going forward what this what this means um, you know as, as far as as far as uh, you've known us as national general um, again you've been a champion of that brand but uh, certainly nothing is going to change in how we uh, partner with you and that's to provide a focus around creating value to you, our distribution partner, to ultimately uh, uh, protect and serve the person who is most important to you, and that's your customer. Um, and and, and uh, as, as we've evolved and we've learned in this space and with the, the, the feedback from you, our agent partners and the partners at Senior Marketing Specialists, um, we feel we've gotten to a really good place at this point in time. And uh, we've got some really, really unique and innovative things that we've done uh, to be part of Allstate Health Solutions part of the greater Allstate Health and Benefits Division of Allstate. And uh, as we move forward, our single purpose is uh, is certain to you. But what is the impact to you on the brand? So again, as, as we mentioned about how, you know, this Friday is gonna be the first day, some of the some of the changes you'll see. Uh, but I, 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 and if you've been with any of our pre-open enrollment, uh, pre-annual enrollment period webinars, you've seen this, but here's what it is. From a holistic uh, standpoint, the good hands Allstate brand that you might see all over the place in terms of the mayhem guy, college football, it's everywhere, even NFL. Um, if you're watching TV, uh, the Allstate brand is familiar to you, but more importantly, it's gonna be familiar to your clients. And that's gonna help out uh, having to overcome that who's national general brand recognition. So that's a huge differentiator from, from that standpoint. 
Uh, it also brings an A plus AM best rating. And uh, especially if your focus is in the financial services sector, financial planning, um, you may be required to work with carriers that have an A plus rating. So that's us. And ultimately too, you wanna know your, your uh, the, the carriers that you work with have financial strength. We, we have 10 X our, our, uh, our, our uh, finances from a standpoint of a $4 billion company. Now we're a $40 billion company. Now you can argue 4 billion is still pretty strong, but going to 40 with a brand to go along with it and a great rating um, just tells a good story overall. Now for you mechanically, um, we get a lot of questions over the last year and a half about the rebrand. And one of those big questions is, do, do our agents need to recontract? The answer to that is no, uh, you do not need to recontract. We are not going to make any changes to any of our plan designs or any of our offerings. Our commissions are going to be a little bit of a different differential and just a simple change of logos there. Um, and there's going to be no disruption to your in-force business. We will be, we are beginning to phase in a communication to your clients that they will receive new Allstate Health Solutions ID cards over the coming weeks and months uh, as we continue on this transition. Um, so fairly simple in terms of uh, what to expect at impact. Um, it's, it's, it's very, very minimal to you, except the ex uh, exciting changes of a familiar brand and uh, some new logos to go along with it, maybe some color schemes and fonts. But as we move forward, what you can expect from us, and uh, we, we're moving forward all things individual. Solutions for all ages. You might come to us because you're an agent in the senior market and, and senior mar marketing specialist, but we also have a suite of a portfolio of under 65 products as well. So no matter if you're in the senior market or the under 65 space or a little bit of both, uh, we have solutions for all agents and solutions for all ages. So we kind of playing on the all there. And uh, as you look at that Swiss Army knife in terms of the of the different type of things that the Swiss Army knife can do, th that's going to be us at Allstate Health Solutions and really just continuing on what we've been able to do at National General, but be able to evolve with more products and services over time to uh, meet uh, consumer needs and market forces. So uh, what, what is available to you? Uh, again, we are a year-round carrier. We are not uh, a Med Advantage or an ACA carrier, so therefore we can serve your clients year-round, um, but we can also uh, be certain that we're going to be pretty busy in the in enrollment period timeframes as well. But if you're contracted with uh, with with us for senior products, you do have uh, turnkey access to these products as well. On the under 65 side, short-term medical, uh, great suite of uh, supplemental products such as accident, critical illness, great dental suite of products, um, products that can help offset out-of-pocket exposure to your clients when they need it most at the time of claim. So if you're in the an under 65 space, I'm gonna get you some contact information here in a minute. But if you're also dabble in the group side, our friends at Allstate Benefits um, do offer a level funded product. If you wanna get in touch with our friends over there, we can get you referred, just let us know. And for under 65 products, if you are interested in learning more, or have some questions, you can always contact Sherry on our team. Uh, she is uh, our under 65 regional sales manager, um, especially if you have clients that retire early or they have, uh, uh, or your turning 65 clients have maybe have a trailing spouse, short-term medical might be a great out, a great option for them and uh, get them from that point in time to when that when that trailing spouse turns 65 as well, or maybe that early retiree has six months to go or something to that effect. So as we as you look, uh, look at National General, uh, soon to be Allstate, it's gonna take a while for us to get used to saying Allstate to here as well, but we've been talking about it a lot lately, so it shouldn't be that bad. Uh, but we, if you uh, want to take a snapshot of this uh, QR code here, um, this will take you to a, re uh, a, a web page that will have recordings of all of our enrollment prep webinars for both under and over 65. Um, so scan that QR code. And then if you uh, have a group of agents that you want to do a uh, uh, intimate uh, style agency training where you bring four or five people to a Zoom call, we are more than willing to do that for you as well to get you prepared for the enrollment season ahead. So let's uh, let's review here though what uh, we're doing on the senior front, and uh, we've had the the, the multi discount med stuff out for some time here now in in Missouri and beyond, and uh, we are only making that story stronger here over the next uh, uh, next couple of weeks here as we re as we do our, our October release. 
And just to review, um, you know, us in the senior market, if you're new to us, uh, we, uh, you know, with that Allstate brand, that's going to be a huge differentiator in this space. Sometimes you might work with a carrier based upon their brand. Sometimes it's going to be rates. Sometimes it's going to be comp. Sometimes it's going to be what is the process. So we're going to solve that uh, brand issue here with Allstate Health Solutions. Um, you're, you can probably already see on some services that you utilize that Allstate Health Solutions is already showing up. Um, in terms of rates, our multi-discount med sup can offer your client up to 25% in stackable discounts if all discounts are exercised. We'll talk about that here in a minute. That innovation um, can, can, can help uh, improve our pricing in terms of climbing up the ranks of a, of a CSG, if you will. Um, and that 25% uh, that can make a huge difference to your client to provide exclusive savings on that front. With our, uh, our e-application, we have a process that's gonna be very simplified for you with our Insta Decision e-app, especially for anniversary rule business. Um, those apps are approved right on the spot and you can have an ID card to your client within an hour in most cases, about 80%, even of our underwriting cases are, are approved on the spot. And those that require further review typically take 48 hours or so. Um, and I say 48 hours or so, it's usually more around 24 to 48. But with our e-application too, we make it simple in the fact that there's uh, uh, signature methods that can meet any need of your clients really. Um, you know, if they're, if they're technologically inclined, they can do electronic signature where they can do a review. Um, if, they're, if they don't have an email address, you can utilize our voice signature option. That's about a four to five minute process that's tied to the application. And then we also have the security question feature, which will allow you to uh, have a touchless signature, um, but establish a security question such as mother's maiden name or uh, what's your favorite color to determine that, uh, that, that signature. So it makes it really simplified, for, especially for those clients that maybe want to do a paper application or maybe that's your process. You can always go back and key it into Enroll Nat Gen, which is our senior market platform, and then that will allow you to uh, uh, utilize that uh, mother's maiden name or that security question to, to make that uh, uh, submission much, much more swift and, and efficient. So talking about the discounts here, and uh, even if you've uh, heard this spiel before, uh, uh, you know, I, I hate to bring it to you again, but it's always good to understand what this means. And, and uh, you know, for some people that, uh, that, are, that look at these discounts, it's still a little bit fuzzy. So uh, we want to make sure that we're, we're getting the, the, the concept to you in a, in a fashion that's simplified to, to understand. So that way there's really no guesswork going forward. Um, but in terms of the discounts, again, there's there's multiple discounts here that apply, but if if utilized together can stack up to a total of 25% in savings, that can be a, a game changer. And it can open up a way to tell some stories for your clients in a world where, you know, meds up is kind of meds up. It is what it is. And it's sometimes it comes down to some of those different factors, but this will allow you to maybe tell a story and uh, and differentiate yourself. Uh, first of all, we are continuing on with what we call the roommate discount. And that discount is 7% offered to those residing with someone in the house 50 years of older. Now that's the roommate, that's the roommate discount. That's going to continue to move forward as, as it has in the past. But we've also uh, uh, taken the roommate discount and juiced it up a little bit to where if there are two people in the same residence that apply at the same time, that discount goes from 7% to 10%. So 7 plus 3, it's a total of 10. So it's either or, you either get the roommate discount or it's the dual applicant if two people in the residence apply. Now, it, we say apply because if let's just say one person applies but they go through underwriting or they, and they don't qualify, then the person who does qualify or maybe is on the anniversary rule will still get the 10% discount. Now, it's not a, 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 in the spirit of the, of, the, of the game here, it's not our intent to where if you know someone is gonna be declined to get that person the 10%. The idea of the discounts here are to say we are going to attract a certain uh, a certain uh, risk factor through our, our the business that's being brought in, to, so we can create a healthier block. That, therefore, over time rates can sustain, but be able to offer these unique discounts as well. And uh, therefore, you're not having to maybe move that business next year because our, the rates look pretty strong long term. So that's on the on the roommate discount, household discount side, whatever you want to call it. Now, when you when you look at the the next discount here, this one is going to be the most interesting of them all, in my opinion, just because you might you're going to find that more clients than not will utilize this one 
and that's going to be if they pay annually your client gets a 10 percent discount now a couple stories you can tell here that 10 percent you're always going to be 10 percent ahead of the curve on any future increases just by paying up front so let's just say you're it's a dual applicant and you have an annual paid an annual pay client now you're up to a 20 percent discount now your client is always going to be 20 percent ahead of the curve and the annual pay discount is an element of financial underwriting if you will um, so therefore those that have the ability to pay typically are uh, typically are are uh, util, uh, utilize strategies to where they save a little more discipline and that type of behavior typically leads to other parts of their life as well and as it pertains to keeping track of their health as well so therefore though and from a persistency perspective and also from you know a financial underwriting perspective that 10 percent we believe is going to, to 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 pay off in the long run and lastly the discount for the activity tracker of five percent is a element of behavioral underwriting for someone that uh, utilizes an activity tracker, such as an Apple Watch or a Fitbit, they're taking proactive measures to watch their health outcomes. And we believe those that do, do take proactive measures have better claim outcomes. So we're willing to split the difference with the client and provide that uh, incentive to attract that client that, that, will, uh, that utilizes that behavior to, to lead to healthier, healthier claim outcomes. Now, in all of this, there's no guarantees, obviously, but at the end of the day, we look at actuarial values and uh, what we've seen in the past, and, and we believe that uh, these discounts are, are, uh, are, are something that uh, we can pass along to your clients to not only tell a different story versus saying, we're going to drop the rates for 25% for everybody in every market. That's not what we're trying, what we're trying to do here. We're trying to, uh, trying to incentivize a healthier outcome for our claims, so therefore, long term, our rates can be remain competitive and sustainable for you. Now, that's just the, the, the discounts. Um, if you're writing business outside of Missouri, there's another caveat to what we call our new rating class, Preferred Select. The Preferred Select rating class goes in addition to our preferred rates and just our standard rates that, uh, that are already in place. So, uh, so uh, in states that are not uh, part of the anniversary or birthday rule, uh, uh, type of enrollment system um, and for underwritten business uh, we uh, uh, your client can qualify for a preferred select and they will be rewarded with a healthier uh, rewarding a healthier client with the best rate available within that preferred select rating class and there's only two qualifications here number one they meet a criteria on the height and weight chart but if you were to look at the height and weight chart between preferred and preferred select Preferred select still kind of falls in the range of what I consider as would be a preferred preferred uh, uh, height and weight. So it's very very uh, I would say pretty pretty lenient on the uh, on the preferred select on the build chart side of things. Uh, so the height weight table, no tobacco, just like before. But the only other qualification is that in the last five years, your client has not been prescribed or recommended uh, to take a medication for depression. So if your client can meet those two qualifications they get preferred select. Uh, we believe that uh, when we went into this, about 70% of our applicants last year would have qualified for preferred select. Um, for, for the states where it is eligible and the submissions that we've had, we are right around that 60 to 70% range. So right in there, maybe a little bit less than what we expected. But at the end of the day, 60 to 70% is still a pretty darn good number to, to take into account. So again, remember this is not available in Missouri, but in other markets, keep, uh, keep in mind that uh, the preferred select rate class is, uh, is, is also part of the equation before you even get into the discounts. And we've made strides to, uh, over the last three, four months, we have some new states that are available to the platform. Uh, all the states that are in blue are roommate discount states only. Uh, we have the, 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 the filings in to get the discounts approved. Um, so we're just TB, TBD on those states. The green states are where the multi-discount states are live uh, and, and you can do a next day effective date. Uh, the states in orange are the states that are gonna be able uh, available for 10-1 effective dates. So uh, one state to make a note here that on the, on the, on the screen is New Jersey. Uh, New Jersey, the discounts are not, are not gonna be available for 10-1, um, but the rates are in New Jersey are, extremely strong to begin with. So you have a, already have a powerful story uh, for, with uh, Allstate Health Solutions here in New Jersey. 
A couple of states to note here though, uh, just close circuit to Missouri. When you look at the states that, uh, that we've, uh, we've, we've added to the platform platform in the portfolio, we've also added new rate states. So the states that are highlighted in blue, those states are where we have, uh, we where we have actually put in new pricing to become more competitive. Um, if I go back to this screen right here, the states in green, if you were to take into account Minnesota down through Louisiana, Nebraska down through Oklahoma, and then into Indiana, Ohio, Kentucky, Tennessee, um, very strong base rates before you even get into the discounts. So as you can see, you know we've had a lot of success in Missouri, and while that's maybe cooled off a little bit, we're making we're making an effort to be to to become more competitive in a broader market base, to therefore be partners with you in some of those markets that you might play in outside of the state of Missouri. So be sure to be looking at National General or Allstate Health Solutions as you look outside of Missouri. Um, as and you get back into the new states, we do have a new charter in five states, including Texas, Colorado. Uh, Pennsylvania, I believe, uh, South Carolina. But we say new charter, but it doesn't really impact you. We're not going to have any new contracting. It's not going to be uh, branded any different. The difference is it goes from National Health Paper to American Heritage is the new paper, but it's all going to be branded as Allstate Health Solutions to therefore make that simplified from a branding perspective, from a notoriety, notoriety perspective, that you're not going to have to remember two brands. So with these states in blue, we've made efforts to, uh, to, to reduce our pricing to become extremely competitive. We're gonna be in the top five in these uh, states, if not better. And then you throw on those discounts, it's really gonna make National General a no brainer to look at, just by, even by virtue of just the, 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 uh, the annual pay, um, that'll, that'll bump us up uh, uh, quite a few slots in these markets, so I encourage you to take a look. So that's some of the new states, um, just to review some of the value adds that are included within our MedSup. Uh, the Amplifon hearing care benefit is included as part of the premium. It's not an add-on. Um, and that's uh, going to be a, a nice benefit for those that uh, might need to, to get their ears checked. Includes all major brands and technology. Um, some of these, some of these uh, hearing services will try to drive your client into a certain manufacturer. This is manufacturer agnostic. Um, great benefits on the uh, uh, evaluations and then also on follow-up care batteries, uh, warranties on loss and damage protection. So uh, uh, be, be sure that uh, if, as you write your clients, they understand that the Amplifon benefit is part of the service. As is Active and Fit Direct, which is our, our gym, ben gym benefit. Um, in a world where it seems like some carriers are getting away from their, their gym benefits because they're underutilized, um, this, this is a, a service that will your client will pay $25 per month. There's no contracts. They can change at any time. Um, and if, if, for example, uh, LA Fitness is included, uh, Anytime Fitness, Snap Fitness, most YMCA's are included as well. Um, but the nice part about this is if you've ever tried to change a gym benefit or, or to get out of a gym membership, um, it's not the easiest thing to do, but this is, uh, offers a $25 a month, no gas on the, uh, on the, on the cost, but uh, no additional costs to uh, uh, change that facility as well should your client move or just something else new open up in their neighborhood. So last tip here on the on the before we move forward on some of these things, uh, the uh, discount or a, a pro tip for you on the discounts. And this is for for those of you writing business in Missouri, just a little bit of a little bit of a, a anniversary real tip for you, especially if you are uh, utilizing a household discount. Let's take into account the dual household discount, and let's just say that roommate, spouse, whatever it is, let's just say they have different anniversary dates. John's anniversary date is today but Mary's isn't until uh, until February of next year. If you are able to underwrite Mary, an idea here would be to underwrite both, or to, to have John go on his anniversary rule, but underwrite Mary today, if she's able, if she qualifies, so that both would, uh, both would qualify for that 10% dual household discount. Otherwise, uh, if they apply separately, John would would only get the roommate discount today, but then Mary would get the would get the the dual discount because John's already with National General. She would get the dual discount next May when she applies. So if you were to underwrite one at the same time, so kind of stay with me here. 
if you're uh, if 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 one if, if John's anniversary is today, but you underwrite Mary today as well, then both would get the 10% dual household discount. So that so the impact to you would be you'd get underwritten comp, underwritten status for both apps or for one of the apps on the agent bonus, and you're you'll get a happy client with 10% for both versus seven percent, you add your, add another three percent savings to the to the uh, to the mix there. So something to keep in mind if you want further explanation on this, certainly uh, certainly let us know. We can kind of walk you through it, maybe paint a picture for you that will uh, help help clear that up. And speaking of bonus, we are going to be launching a fourth quarter bonus to be announced soon. We'll be on Allstate branded material as uh, we get past the, the, the 30th year and uh, we officially make that switch. So how it's gonna look, contest period is gonna cover fourth quarter. If you were to submit 10 to 19 applications in uh, Q4, that uh, there'll be some persistency that will be on the flyer. Uh, back to policy, we pay back to application number one, we would pay $100 for underwritten business and open enrollment business. So if you have clients that are turning 65, we will pay for that turning 65 business as well. Previously something we did not do. And then for anniversary birthday rule, it would be 50 for apps, uh, for applications 10 through 19 written. If in Q4 you're, you are you write 20 to 29 applications, we simply bump those numbers up to 150 and, fi and uh, 50. And then uh, for 30 plus applications, it's $200 for underwritten and open enrollment and 100 for birthday or anniversary rule. So the more that you write with National General in Q4, the sweeter your bonus will be. If you were to write 30 applications uh, with NatGen, or actually it will be 30 applications with all state health solutions, that would, and they're all birth or anniversary rule, then that would be a $3,000 bonus on top of your commission. So nice little incentive here for Q4. And in addition, a little kicker for you, if you were to uh, combine a, a national or Allstate Health Solutions MedSup with a dental vision hearing plan with Allstate, that, uh, that application bonus is going to get a $50 kicker as well for the dental vision hearing sale combo. So therefore, a, a underwritten application uh, 10 through 19 could be $150 if you were to add a DVH to each of those applications. And if you think about it too, as you talk, to, talk about the discount story here, you, there's a few different ways you can maybe say to this client, you know, Mr. Miss Client, by exercising these discounts, we just saved you two months worth of premium. Or Mr. Miss Client, you know what, we added a dental benefit into this because all these discounts that you that you qualified for, they allow us to put a really nice dental plan on here that's going to uh, cover uh, a major services day one. So all the sorts of different kind of stories here all can add up to uh, not only uh, 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 positive outcomes, but additional cash for you as well, in the form of bonuses. So all good things there. And speaking of dental, uh, don't forget about the, this season uh, to uh, look at a National General Allstate's dental plan. Uh, if you haven't seen this dental plan, it's uh, 55 plus, so it, it uh, will can qualify. Or your your pre-retiree clients can qualify. Um, the biggest things here are no uh, no waiting periods for basic and major services. So 25% coverage day one. Um, also has uh, dentures and implants available and some uh, nice discounts here as well. In Missouri, there is a preferred discount. Um, anyone who's had a, a filling crown root canal or denture in the last 12 months that uh, would be, I'm sorry, uh, outside of Missouri. Preferred discount was not approved by the state of Missouri, but everywhere else except Missouri, the preferred discount does apply. In Missouri, the bundling discount does apply though. So if you bundle the senior dental plan with uh, the, the NatGen, not only will you get a uh, credit toward that bonus of 50 bucks, but you, your client will get a 10% bundling discount if it's written with our, our MedSup or any of our other uh, meds or other senior products as well. And a couple things here with the, with the, the, the dental plan. 100% uh, coverage across the board. Our level one, you can get your client uh, cleaning for prevent or, or preventive cleanings at 100% for under 20 bucks a month, which is a great deal. Um, but then you get into the basic services. So you'll see that there's a first year and a second year benefit. So it has increasing benefits. Well, take a look at that level three on the basic services on year two. It's 100% coverage for basic services as well. 
So I can't get any better in terms of coverage 100%. So that's a, a strong benefit that you can pass on to your client. Again, major services, day one, 25% increases to year two. Dentures, implants covered, annual maximum up to 3,000. So we'll put this dental plan up against any in the market, uh, competitive commissions as well. And uh, 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 if you're, you can also sell this as a standalone as well. So if you just like to sell dental plans all day, you can certainly sell this as a, uh, as a standalone. On our under 65 platform, we have a similar product as well called Select Dental. Um, instead of the implants and dentures, has orthodontia on our on our level three plan. So uh, we're we're making as a as a company as the all things individual a, a big push on dental insurance to become a a major player in this space as well. Um, so we will be uh, uh, announcing some more under sixty five dental uh, things here coming up here in the next couple of weeks to go along with it. And um, as I talk to some of your, if you've uh, uh, worked with some of your marketers at uh, Senior Marketing Specialists, uh, had a conversation with one here at the St. Louis AHU event a couple weeks back. Um, some of you probably know and love, I'm not gonna out him here on the call, but uh, in any event, uh, he's really high on our senior indemnity product for a lot of reasons. Number one, it's it's a product that's not not widely, widely available, but it serves a nice niche for you in the market. But it does a couple things. There's base plans and max plans. First off, it's a 30 state footprint, including Missouri. It's a fixed benefit indemnity product. So it's ideal for somebody who is maybe waiting Medicare eligibility. Maybe they missed their window. Um, maybe, maybe they signed up for part A uh, to get on social security number, but they maybe they retired late and they didn't uh, apply for part B on time, but they're locked out of, uh, of that uh, window for getting onto part B because of that delayed uh, delayed uh, eligibility and they didn't qualify because maybe they didn't have a group plan. Uh, or if it's somebody that uh, maybe didn't uh, have enough credits to qualify or newly or recently emigrated to the United States, this could be a great option to help, su help support Part A. But we have five benefit levels, talked about the, the base plans and the max plans. Uh, the base plans are going to be similar to hospital indemnity product, but the max plans are going to provide a, a more enhanced benefit that's going to include hospital, surgical, medical, uh, skilled nursing, et, et cetera, uh, office visit reimbursement as well. So to help cover the things that Part A might not cover uh, while your client waits their Medicare eligibility. But these benefits are paid lump sum, so they pay, they're paid to your client, so that's indemnity. So uh, very easy to understand. So I encourage you to, to give us some remarketers to take a look at that as well. And lastly, expanding into 2023, if you have uh, not, uh, not been made aware of as, as of yet, we do have a new product coming and that's final expense. So if you are in the final expense uh, uh, game, um, you'll have the Allstate Health Solutions brand to uh, fall, fall back on when it comes to final expense. And that could be a huge differentiator in that space. Um, I'm not going to go through all these one by one, but if you understand all the all the the, the final expense information, um, you, in terms of uh, some of the different benefits that we're going to uh, be offering along, 46 state filing footprint is what we have. We're going to be launching 25 states first quarter of 2023. Um, preliminary uh, review of pricing looks extremely competitive. Commissions look extremely competitive as well. So we're just going to tease you with that for now, and uh, we'll come back here toward the first of the year. And uh, uh, we have it on the radar now, but we're going to get it uh, into your into your laps here as we uh, uh, turn the page on 2022 and into 2023. A little bit more on the branding. So when it comes to uh, bro brochures and marketing materials, especially in the senior market, um, we have. Uh, have the requirement to refile all of the uh, all of our state brochures and materials. So therefore, perfect timing enrollment period. Um, we're going to be a little bit uh, hodgepodge on the marketing materials, especially as it pertains to all state. We do have some approved states, so including Missouri, uh, the, 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 the those brochures will be available at the uh, what was NatGen Health. They'll also be available in ENG. Um, Pending approval, we have about uh, eight states that have given us objections and said, you know, fix this or fix that or reword this or reword that. Um, but if it's not any of the pending approval states or the approved states, um, so for example, uh, uh, Kansas or Arkansas, uh, Kansas or Arkansas, you can expect those brochures to come around mid-October. In terms of paper applications, 
those were largely branded as of the uh, paper, so national health insurance. Um, so those those applications will remain the same uh, going forward. There might be a couple tweaks here and there, but those will be communicated to you as those are updated. Again, those would have to be refiled as well. So uh, until we, uh, and for time being, if you do see national general in the paper applications, it'll, it'll remain that way until those get refiled. Uh, but once they are refiled, there will be communication sent out to you that uh, those paper applications are no longer valid to, uh, to utilize uh, the new applications that will be posted on our, our agent sites. So with all that being said, um, I'm sure we probably missed a few things here just with the branding, rebrand, because there's, uh, there's a, lot of, uh, a lot of things that go into it. Um, in terms of our, our public site uh, at natgenhealth.com, that will redirect to our uh, new site, which I believe is going to be allstatehealth.com. Um, so as we get to get there, we'll to kind of show you, show you where that to look. Um, but also too, after today, take a snapshot of Chris's uh, QR code. Many of you know Chris in terms of uh, our senior, being our senior product uh, sales manager. Um, get on Chris's radar if you need help uh, navigating the e-application. Um, going over some of these discounts or formulating some strategies or structures or maybe doing some business planning with those discounts and whatnot, uh, be sure to get with Chris here after today to uh, uh, and get on his calendar to, to make sure that you are all set and ready to go when all the lights turn on. And uh, especially as, as you think of MedSup, if you have MedSup clients to get out of the way before all your MedAdvantage, um, you certainly want to get on the, on the stick here with that with Chris. So just some, some additional updates here to uh, some of our systems and whatnot, um, especially if you're utilizing CSG. Another, uh, 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 I wouldn't call it a pain point, but a point of contention has just been how our discounts have been viewed in CSG. And, um, you know, when you look at CSG, we typically in a lot of cases, we're coming up to the top of the list, uh, but you'll notice that there's like four or five, and in some cases, maybe six or seven, uh, listings for national general or national health or all state. So what the, the the key trick here is that as you see the little carrot there at the top, um, the, the key is to click on that to expand the record. And then under the rating class, it'll say what that uh, what that discount is. So if it's a preferred select rating class, wearable with the dual household discount, for example, that's where you're going to be, be determining what that discount is. And uh, and what you're going to be what you should be looking for uh, uh, on that uh, on that page for the annual pay discount. The annual pay discount. There's a, a bar on the side of the uh, side of the screen in CSG that will require you to click on the annual rate button. That will calculate the annual uh, annual pay rate for for all the carriers there, especially all uh, all state. But there are going to be some enhancements that are going to be made here in the next couple of weeks. Uh, CSG will show the discount percentage, so that will be extremely helpful to know what your client is getting. The discounts will be rewarded. So, for example, um, instead of household and then slash dual, there will be a uh, uh, roommate and then there will be dual. So you'll know if your client is getting the roommate or if they're getting the dual discount. Um, so that will be uh, certainly a uh, uh, easier uh, easier way to or easier pathway to understand what that is. Uh, there's been some uh, instances where there's been duplicates. Those will be deleted. Um, and as a as a kind of a first to market, CSG already has Allstate Health Solutions branded as the carrier. So no longer does it say National Health in parentheses Allstate. It says Allstate Health Solutions. And lastly, uh, the application uh, inside of CSG is alive today. So you can actually do your enrollments through CSG. Um, uh, when, when it comes to the actual application, that is live in CSG. But if you like what you see in CSG, we encourage you to just go to enroll that gen to continue the process um, because that will take you through our application, will always be updated in real time, and uh, we'll simply put you through that application process. We'll ask you what that, uh, what that enrollment type is. So if it's anniversary rule, it will only populate questions pertinent to the anniversary rule. Um, and then also too with those simplified signature options such as the, the passphrase, that's going to be a, 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 a very efficient way for you to get business done, especially in the busy season. So um, one other piece on the technology to keep in mind, if you haven't been in, been in our systems for a while, 
Um, all activities are, are now going to run through your agent back office. Uh, prior to three weeks ago, we had a system for under 65, senior, a senior market system, a uh, back office login. So you're working with three or four different systems and logins. We've consolidated to have one touch point be through your agent back office. So the other thing we've done though too is we have implemented a two-factor authentication system. So therefore, um, it will remember a device, therefore added security for you, your information, any of your agent's information, and then also for your uh, client information. But what that might do is if you have, maybe you have a, a CSR in your office that utilizes your system, um, they might be might have to go to your machine or be remembered from your machine or have to get the, the two-step authentication from you uh, to, through your email address or your phone number. Um, but there is a way for multiple users to be utilized on that. So uh, get with Chris and he can show you how to get that done. But in your back office here, you have the ability to utilize uh, functions to see your clients, um, pending applications if you have submitted paper applications that have been keyed in. You can get guides to all things, uh, agent guides, uh, senior market agent guides, which will have information on how to implement the, the uh, activity tracker discount to, to connect with that, state availability grids, all, all that good stuff. This, is, this page here will be rebranded to Allstate on Friday morning. Now, let's knock on wood, because obviously again, with any transition or rebrand, there's bound to be some things that are delayed, but uh, our goal here is to make it as seamless as possible. And lastly, um, with this system, you have the ability to see any past due payments, NSFs, whatnot. You can appoint an agent, but you'll go to the quote senior button and that will take you to enroll in that gen where you can go through the process of uh, doing an application. So that's, uh, that's all I have for today, just some of the updates and the review of the discounts. And uh, hopefully this is a, a good way to say goodbye to National General and welcome Allstate on Friday. So I'm going to turn it back over to, to Sadie to see if there's any questions or uh, anything that uh, you know, we can uh, uh, clear up here before we get back into the mix of doing business. Yes, absolutely. Thanks, Andy. We do have a few questions here. So the first one is state specific. Uh, Anthony is asking, is Illinois an all discounts available state? Yes, uh, all discounts will be available in Illinois uh, as of 10-1. Yeah, and so for some of those states such as uh, Colorado, Texas, Illinois, uh, we those states cannot be quoted today, but as of Friday, you should be able to quote them for will, will be 10-2 effective dates. Uh, sorry, 10-1 effective dates. So Friday's the 30th, yep. Perfect. Um, let's see, Kimberly is asking, what is the DVH network you guys use? Uh, great question, I didn't touch on that. It's the Aetna Dental Administrators Network. Um, this network is actually one of Aetna's largest dental networks that they don't even utilize themselves for a lot of their offerings. Um, the nice part, it's a passive network. So if there is an out-of-network scenario, it's just simply going to be the uh, reasonable customer. There's no out-of-network charges or costs associated with it. It's just going to be the out-of-network uh, uh, maximum allowable amount. Awesome. Perfect. Um, we have someone asking, what is wearable? Uh, sorry, I think I missed that. So whenever you use the term wearable, what do you mean by that? Sure. Yeah, so wearable, activity tracker, um, whatever you want to call it. So as long as it's a device that can can connect to tracking steps, it's like a step counter, if you will. Um, the device can be an Apple Watch, a Fitbit, a Garmin watch. Um, uh, any device that can connect to uh, an app on a phone, if you will. So it's the 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 connection is app based. So when you when your client connects to uh, Allstate for the the step tracker, it's going to connect to one of one of five apps: Apple Fitness, Google Fitness, Fitbit, Garmin, or Under Armour. As long as that device is compatible with one of those five apps, it, it works. Now, there's a little little bit of a pro tip here as well is that especially for like Apple Fitness or Google Fitness, uh, those step counters are sometimes based within the app itself. So therefore, you, as long as it connects to that app and it's, and it's, and it's uh, tracking the steps, they don't need to have a device or, or a, a, an Apple Watch, if you will. So, um, you know, in some cases we've had uh, stories of agents that have uh, they have left the meeting with their client and they said, okay, give us this discount. We're gonna go to Target on the way out. We're gonna get a Fitbit. 
or they've utilized just the, the app-based service of it and connected to the app. Um, it's not for everybody. It's not, uh, you know, for, for, for sake of the steps. We're not, we're not tracking minimums. We're not saying you have to have 10,000 steps a day to, to qualify or to keep the discount. It's just a, a great way for us to you know, incentivize someone who is looking to uh, be proactive, but also, you know, help us formulate future claims data as well. Yeah, for sure. And, you know, that's something that's really popular right now. I know I have my Garmin watch. I'm always counting my steps every day. Um, and especially, I mean, my granddad, he's 90 years old and his form of exercise is he goes on walks every single day. He doesn't miss it. So that is for sure something that's very popular and can for sure be utilized. Um, absolutely. Now, if, you're like, if you're like me, though, that has an Apple watch and has the steps, but you look at it about uh, three o'clock in the afternoon and see that you're your uh your apple watch is dead <laughs> then yeah. you gotta, gotta stay on, on top of it a little more a little little, little uh little, little outing myself here on uh, my my level of activity tracking these days yeah, yeah yeah exactly yes um let's see uh which rate do i quote for an open enrollment rate so yeah that's a little bit more specific yeah that's a good question so um when it comes to preferred select um, if it, and especially this is uh, this is uh, outside of Missouri, for example, right now. So states that have preferred select, so Kansas, Iowa, Arkansas, at at turning 65, the preferred select actually defaults to, uh, or the the preferred select is only available for underwritten business, but the preferred rate is available for turning 65 business, and it actually defaults to the preferred select rate, even though it's only considered a preferred risk. Um, just because by law we at turning 65, we have to give the lowest rate available. Now, that being said, in Missouri, you don't have to worry about that. But if you're just so, so you know, outside of Missouri, that's what you're going to experience. Uh, but with the discounts uh, for turning 65 business, you can apply the discounts for those folks as well. So really, it's just a matter of what rate you choose is are they are they going to uh, uh, utilize any of those discounts that are available to them? In which one? So, you know, you say up to 25%, the discount might be five if they're only utilizing the activity tracker discount. It could be 12 if it's roommate plus activity tracker. It could be 22, 17, 20, whatever it would be in between. It's just a matter of what that client, um, what they're, uh, what, what they're able to access based upon their situation. Alrighty, absolutely. Let's see. Where can we go to find the network dental providers, the in-network dental providers? Yep, that's a great question. You can either go to uh, natchenhealth.com uh, for existing customers. There, are be, there will be links there. Um, also, in the quoting tool, there will be access to the brochure, which will uh, the brochure will also have a link, a live link on the PDF to go to the network as well. And I believe in e and enroll that gen, there might be a link there. Don't quote me on that, but at least it'll take you to the brochure that will have the live link on the brochure. Perfect. And there are a few of you that are asking for some information and stuff like that. Hold tight. We'll send out a follow-up email that will have the information that you're asking for. Um, so why I give you guys a few more minutes to put in some questions. Andy, I have a few questions of my own just to wrap up here. So you kind of hit on this at the very beginning and kind of throughout, but you all are switching to Allstate and that's a huge brand name. So could you kind of talk on how important or like the kind of impact that taking on such a huge name brand can do for people or have on people? Yeah, uh, you know, as, as I mentioned that National General was uh, is, is a, a fairly popular brand on the PNC side in a lot of markets, especially in the South, Southeast and in the West. Um, but National General as a health insurance carrier, a lot of times we were getting confused with the little green man, the giant, the Shaquille O'Neal commercials or whatever, you know what I mean? So you know that that that's the that, that was almost a, a running joke that through our time at National General when I when we when we were acquired at Assurance Health by National National General we became National General that was the first year of having to overcome are you the little green the green guy right so the Allstate brand though is in in my opinion one of the most widely recognized brands in general across the country um, and even more so than maybe some of the the the, the top Medicare carriers today, but for different reasons, right? And so you throw a brand name such as Allstate into the mix with those carriers, 
and as we just as we put that onto a Medicare supplement uh, uh, product, that that alone is going to uh, lend credibility. But number two, and that was number one. This is number two. Um, number two is that you no longer have to overcome that objection. Who's national general? And that just makes that sale more comfortable, more at ease. They know who Allstate is. Now there's some some states and markets where Allstate maybe not as big as others, but we've all seen the Mayhem commercials. We've all seen, you know, Alicia Keys is one of the spokespersons. Um, you know, the the guy that with the deep voice that used to do the commercials. And then, you know, you're you're in SEC country. So you go if you watch a Mizzou game or wherever, or if you're a Razorback fan, what have you. You see it all over on on the field. You see it on the goalposts, all over the halftime shows. Um, you know, NCAA basketball, NFL games. So just the brand is everywhere. So it's 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 going to be something that's widely recognized. The good hands of uh, have always been a brand that's recognized, and it's just it just takes away that element of who is who are who is this company. And the other thing too, and to that piggyback. It's not like we're just Allstate is just jumping into this. You know, we're we're a, a carrier that our our pay, our paper, the National Health brand, has been around for 55 years. So it's it's a it's a carrier that's been been in business, doing business, but just now has the power of a brand and a company behind it. Yes, absolutely. Yes. Um, let's see. I have a few questions on here, but I'll pick just one more before we get out of here. Um, so we know that AEP is mainly, we think of Medicare Advantage prescription drug plans, but we also know that it is the number one time of year for Medicare supplements to be written as well. So while we're kind of gearing up for that, what would you think, Andy, in your personal opinion, what do you think um, is some big major highlights of these National General Medi Medicare supplements kind of compared to uh, some of their competitors and some other plans that people will be looking at this time of year? Absolutely, certainly it's the discounts. If I'm, if I'm going anywhere, it's the discounts. And um, you know, that's setting us apart right now. Um, it's, it's, it's created a bunch, uh, a lot of buzz in the market, tying it with the, the change in the Allstate uh, uh, brand. Um, I don't. I think our, our story in the med subfront is as powerful as anyone, just by virtue of the fact that the discount concept is not widely not widely available in the market. So uh, again, as, as I mentioned earlier, it allows an element of storytelling in a world where everything is pretty much the same. So you know, especially as our especially in Missouri, the the F business is very strong still for us. Um, but outside of Missouri too, you you, you throw in the G and N. Um, you know we're extremely competitive on across the board on on all those uh, all those products or all those levels, and uh, you know we're we're bringing it to we're bringing it to more streets across the country. So. Yeah, absolutely. I love it. Well, it looks like we don't have any more questions here. Um, so we won't take up anybody else's any more time uh, here. So uh, thank you so much, Andy, for joining us today. Like I said, you guys, you will be receiving a follow-up call and follow-up email after this. We'll have some resources and um, just some recaps of what we talked about here today. But thank you all so much. And thank you, Andy. All right. Thank you, Sadie. Thank you, everyone. Appreciate your time. Bye.